The spring summer of 2024 may have been marked by practicality and ongoing minimalism, but it was also a season marked by journeys that celebrated unique craftsmanship, where the lines of innovation showcased fashion's genius creativity. And it came in plenty, a definitive move back towards expressionism. We saw plenty of artful, romantic, and even surreal collections grace the runway. Perhaps, the most enigmatic was a focus on genuine artisanal creativity. Materials, such as Glenn Martins's wired pieces and Junior Watanabe's collages were crunched, twisted, and sculpted into beautiful tactile volumes. These ranged from pom-pom embellished mesh at Bottega Veneta to artful cutouts at Valentino in a lattice work of shells. With an evident inclination toward intricacy and detail, fringes and feathers festooned pieces in a flurry of texture and movement. Their interpretations varied, from Loewe's nuanced feather details to the unabashedly extravagant, paradisiacal feather displays on Bottega Veneta's floor-length dress. Simultaneously, Prada reimagined fringes in a lustrous silver, crowning them as the limelight's stealing elements of the spring collection. Masculinity found a curious yet eloquent expression through dominant broad shoulders seen in stealthy appearances at Otiko and Issy Miyaki, these squared, and at times, pointed shoulders at Rick Owens paradoxically carved out a feminine silhouette by cinching at the waist, creating an arresting visual dialogue between form and fluidity. Bottega Veneta's Matthew Blasey elevated craftsmanship by magnifying innovative textiles and classic elegance. With airy pom-pom embellishments and fine mesh narrating the brand's tale, Blasey elegantly swung between serene explorations and experimental couture, exploring detailed narratives etched in every garment. Conversely, Rick Owens offered ethereal elegance with silk capes, where rounded hems waltzed with the wind and accordion pleated tulle and organza portrayed weightless charm. The collection's bubble mini dress, awash in soft pink folds, whispered subtle yet grounded resilience and craft into the runway's atmosphere. In a poignant act of feminine symbolism, Sarah Burton for Alexander McQueen cloaked the runway with the enveloping power of Abakanovic's textile sculptures and a bold homage to the female form and historical potency. A crescendo of blood-red roses, symbology, and an unwavering artistic vision encapsulated an unyielding reflection of powerful, uncompromising creativity. Amidst the volumes and the structure, the rose asserted itself through multiple collections, including delicately scattered at Balmain. Marnie's Francesco Riso unveiled a series of enchanting decoupage, embodying visual enchantment and delicate craftsmanship. Under Casey Cadwallader's aegis, Mugler sculpted high-impact bustier and introduced a vibrant reimagining of Thierry's original B headpiece from spring 1997. Juxtaposed with a chrome leather body plate for Beyoncé's Renaissance tour, Cadwallader gestured towards audacious elegance and creative reinvention. Maison Margiela articulated a fierce imagination presenting a collection that exuded a breathtaking essay in breaking down and translating elements of high fashion. The deconstructed white shirt collars at the model's necks hinted at the house's fluency in couture technique and rule-breaking vigor brought forth by Galliano. In an industry that often straddles the lines between innovation and tradition, this season, offered a cascade of designs that acknowledged the beauty and necessity found in craftsmanship and heritage, 
breathing new life with a potent blend of creative instinct and meticulous execution. In the spring of 2024, the fashion world witnessed a majestic transformation, as designers drew inspiration from the opulence of monarchy and regal aesthetics. Runways across major fashion capitals were graced with collections that blended contemporary designs with elements reminiscent of royal attire, from intricate brocade patterns to luxurious fabrics. This trend was marked by a sophisticated palette, incorporating rich purples, deep blues, and metallic golds, bringing an air of aristocracy to modern silhouettes. Accentuated by accessories like tiara-like headpieces and ornate, jewel-encrusted belts, this season's fashion reimagined the allure of royalty, making it accessible and desirable in the realm of everyday style. Today's designers are going back to school. Academia was trending on the spring 2024 runways. It's an aesthetic motif that comes up again and again across the world of fashion, perhaps because it invites reflection on so many relevant themes, the joy of learning, the drama of growing up, the way dress codes shape our perception of each other and ourselves. A look back to school days also provides lots of inspiration for how to get clever and creative within the restraints of formal dressing, which is the side back toward which the needle has undoubtedly swung as of late. On this front, Miu Miu's disheveled subversion of prep school uniforms was definitely a standout, but we saw plenty of brands and designers take the idea in a number of directions as with Marnie's Café Society Bohemianism or Chanel's Sexy Secretaries. We saw punk riffs on schoolgirl skirts from Kopova Loena, a move that's indebted of course to Vivian Westwood, where Andreas Kronthula continued to work his irreverent magic. J.W. Anderson gave us a claymation version of an out-of-dress code day ensemble, while Dries Van Noten borrowed from the iconic rugby shirt as he encouraged us that it's okay to do a bit of peacocking.
Rugged Elegance Spring 2024 runway can be seen embracing gender-fluid elegance and rugged chic. The fashion landscape ushers in a powerful shift as designers liberate their creations from traditional gender constraints. Discarding conventional notions of the ideal feminine silhouette, a resurgence of strong shoulders and boxy fits takes center stage, redefining the importance of form in fashion. This trend celebrates the charm of effortlessly laid-back ensembles, showcasing frumpy sweaters, casual chic workwear, and dynamic two-piece sets, all artfully accessorized with chunky shoulder bags and simple baseball hats. The result? A captivating fusion of tomboy elegance and rugged chic that defies outdated gender norms. Thoughtful femininity Longevity in fashion often intertwines with a timeless allure and subtle sophistication, allowing designs to transcend mere seasonal trends. This essence of thoughtful femininity in the SS24 collections gently permeates through the delicate embrace of purely and, simply put, feminine clothes. It highlights designers' creative endeavors to display clothes for reality's sake. Organza, lace, pastels, slim fits, careful constructions, sexy and feminine without being subversive, attributes firmly felt across the SS24 runways. Details were key with soft draping caressing the body and cut out so acutely proportioned to be subtle yet feminine and sexy. Delicate draping, meticulously proportioned cutouts, and subtle, body skimming silhouettes underscore the theme, marrying gentle exposure with dignified modesty. Card unfurls a palette of voluminous silk blouses and sheer organza dresses in New York. At the same time, at Carolina Herrera, under the creative directorship of Wes Gordon, the brand revisits its roots with a provocative twist on occasion wear, juxtaposing sheer white tulle and black lace midi skirts with a standout lilac lace bra top and coordinating skirt. Tove delivers a collection that eloquently speaks of streamlined, slinky, and sultry with its fluid, backless satin gowns and lace paneling. presenting romantic pieces inviting women to embody their authentic selves gracefully. Giada's Gabriele Colongello, an unsung creative hero of the fashion world, brought forth a collection echoing utter femininity with sheer overlays juxtaposed delightfully against subtly draped materials, which swathed protectively and seductively around the female form. Meanwhile, Kim Jones for Fendi meticulously crafted a collection to generate impact through nuance, where knitwear blouses, cardigans, skirts, and dresses became architectural canvases, intertwined to create striking forms from traditional elements, the use of paper-like, shiny Finnish linen, particularly in a distinctive canary yellow, evoked memories of a Lagerfeld collection from 24 years prior illustrating the timelessness embedded in thoughtfully feminine pieces. Carolina Herrera's Wes Gordon envisioned pieces, such as a lilac lace bra top and matching skirt, which marry the playful with the sophisticated, offering several inches of bare midriff to tease the eye cautiously. With a reputation as a designer for the thoughtful woman, Gabriella Hurst tailors an elegant pantsuit with responsibly sourced or dead stock materials, showcasing it with a white button-down and an exaggerated pointy collar, encapsulating an effortlessly chic and ethically conscious aesthetic.
At Chloe, Gabriella Hurst unveils a collection that marries sustainability with sophistication, utilizing drawings of poppies, orchids, and calla lilies as a foundation, resulting in dresses with spiraling ruffled knit and draped suede. Kite, on the other hand, takes us through a conversation between hard and soft, where billowy silk blouses and pin-tucked organza dresses stand juxtaposed against motorcycle jackets and precision tailoring. Jill Sander by Lucy and Luke Meyer move through elongated lines and modern knitting technology to fuse comfort with contemporary corporate wear. However, the knit dresses with clingy ribbed bodices that bloomed into fuller skirts beneath the waist signaled a thoughtful evolution toward demure celebration. In this celebration of femininity, designers presented a dimension where delicate aesthetics, subtle sensuality, and tangible comfort harmoniously converge, paving a path where the lines between the feminine, the romantic, and the pragmatically beautiful are thoughtfully blurred, discreetly unveiling the form beneath in an ode, to an effortlessly sexy, yet beautifully understated elegance. <laughs>